In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to record from USB microphone into directly into Premiere Rush. So we have our project or sequence or timeline, whatever open. And if we go to Premiere Rush preferences and we're just going to check our audio input. So right now I have system default USB PNP audio device. So yes, this is my microphone. If I clicked this, a built-in microphone is microphone from the laptop, which is not very good. I would not recommend this. And this is created from Zoom and I show you this is what I've created. So this is my microphone. You can leave it by system default. And of course output are the speakers. So let's click OK. And here is not the first time. So if this was first time, you would get the message here asking your computer to allow the microphone so and here by the way this is what you would see okay so here at the left bottom control tracks so if you click this button you're going to expand your timeline view and you have some options here so here target track for recording so I can record into track one, two or three. So it doesn't really matter. So I'm just going to literally click this. Tap to record. So now I got my track ready right now. And if I tap again, I get the countdown. And right now I'm recording directly into my Premiere Rush. So you can't see the levels right now, but that's usually for this kind of recording directly into the software. It's the, the same deal everywhere. So you can speak and speak. And when, once you want to finish, you just click this button again, tap to stop recording. And there you go. And you could see like for split second. Let me expand audio for a split second the forms went down because what rush does it it just levels for you so you never worried about um, volume being too loud or too quiet so it actually does everything for you and right now I'm recording directly into my premiere here I can see my levels so which are pretty good you can't see the levels right now but that's usually for this kind of recording directly into the song and here if I click on the audio options, right? So here's my volume. So if this sounds too much and I can lower this slightly or make it really loud. And of course, to make our job easier, you can just hit auto volume and you can see that it went down. So exactly when I stopped recording it went down because it was set to auto volume balance sound if I click that it basically balances the highs and lows reduce background noise reduce echo enhance speech higher pitch you can play with this kind of um, effects and functions of course later on but the point was to record directly into Rush and it could never be easier to be honest and of course let me just put this at the front and if you want to share you can do that but remember that it's going to be a video as mp4 so um, yeah the, the, the awesome part is that Rush will literally do everything for you so we don't really have to think about um, the volume and noise and stuff like that. So that's really cool. So thank you for <laughs> thank you for watching and subscribe and see you in the next video.